An outpouring of love and support for a fallen police officer. Today, the community said a final farewell to Officer Clayton Townsend. A long police procession made its way to Christ Church of the Valley in Peoria, where family, friends, and fellow officers spoke about the legacy Officer Clayton Townsend left behind in just the 26 short years on this earth. Tonight, we have team coverage of what's going on today. Let's begin with Team 12's Mike Gonzalez. He's live with us here in the studio with more on the outpouring of support for this fallen officer. Mike. Mark and Caribe, good evening. It was such a heart-wrenching memorial service because you could really tell the impact that this young officer had on so many people. He was a father, husband, and a man of faith. He spent five years as a police officer for Salt River, and everyone that crossed his path seemed much better for it. Often the impact one has on this earth isn't measured in the number of years they've lived, it's the multitude of lives that they've touched. I had the honor to be Clayton's brother and spend 26 years on this earth sharing hundreds of memories and learning from him. He lived a life that glorified God, found true love, had a beautiful baby. Family, friends, and fellow officers remembered how Officer Clayton Townsend lived with honor, faith in God, and a gentle way with everyone he came into contact with. He put people at ease, and above all, he treated everyone like family. You and your family have conquered hardships that would crush most. You have beaten cancer. You and Deanna, against all odds, created Brixton, the true miracle baby. Deanna and Brixton will always be taken care of, so rest easy. At just 26 years old, Officer Townsend leaves behind his 25-year-old wife, Deanna, and 10-month-old son, Brixton. But what will endure in Officer Clayton Townsend's death is an example of how to live one's life. I'd like to repeat one of the scriptures that was shared before that Clayton loved. It said, blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the sons of God. Your peacemaker is now at peace with his maker. And there is a GoFundMe page set up to help his widow Deanna with the expenses. I'll put that link on 12news.com. And coming up in our six o'clock hour, I'll show you how Officer Townsend was honored outside the church today. Okay, Mike, thanks.